It's all you, sir. Amen. Well, praise God for the victory yesterday. <clears throat> this is Ken Hoven, May 19. I was told that mine is the first victory in nine years in that courthouse. That's what one of the um, marshals at the course at the courthouse said. He'd never seen anybody win in nine years. Ours was the first. Praise God for that. <clears throat> anyway, that is only step one of the victory now. Step two is I'm still sitting here in an orange jumpsuit, so we got to get this all worked out where I can actually go home home. And step three is to get the original 2006 case overturned. So please keep praying for that. Paul is still fighting the legal battle for his two crazy charges, so there's still more to go there. If you do want to keep helping the Legal Defense Fund or just the Kent Hoven uh, Get Out of Prison, Start the Ministry Up Again Fund, Ernie Land is handling all of that. You can uh, get a hold of Ernie. That would be a great blessing. So praise God for all those that prayed and worked and uh, I feel very much like the Apostle Paul must have felt in Philippians chapter 1. You know, the things that happened have fallen out to the furtherance of the gospel. I think there are probably thousands or tens of thousands that have heard about the gospel, have heard about Jesus Christ, um, and been saved, maybe many of them, precisely because of this case, who would not have heard otherwise. So I want to thank all of you that worked so hard in spreading, shining the light and making noise. Praise God. <clears throat> Please, don't get weary. It is not over yet. So hang in there. If you read the story of Gideon, after they won the great victory by shining the light and making noise, they still had to chase the enemy around for a while to get a complete victory. So read, read that story of Gideon back there in the Bible, and <clears throat> you'll see in the book of Judges. It's not quite over yet, but praise God for the victory number one. I remember when I, the, I read a lot of history and the, the patriots in the uh, 1770s and 80s fighting the British. George Washington lost almost every battle with the British and, and won the war. They just simply wouldn't quit. Uh, he'd lose every battle. Strategic retreat, I think they called it. Uh, so anyway, praise God, we've lost everything except finally one victory. Uh, so I, I want to thank all of you from the bottom of heart. Is, uh, this call is from the State of Lincoln County Sheriff's Office. Heartrending for me to realize all the people that have helped and all the expense and the time. And Praise God. It'll be worth it all in eternity. Thank you all. And if I can do anything, uh, please let me know. Um, I still want to serve the Lord with the rest of my life. I've only got about 40 years left, so if I can help, let me know. Thank you, brother.